Hi Lara. Hi Rocky. How are you? So Lara, today I'm going to ask you a couple of questions. Okay. The first question, what do you think about me as a... <laughs> Shut up. What do you think about me as a person and as a designer, a creative person? Okay. Uh, well, the Rocky that I've known over the years, I think the one thing is that you've always remained the same person. Regardless of what success you may have had or you know how big a designer you have become <laughs> No, I think that's the one thing. I think that's always been consistent. You've always been someone who's been a lot of fun You've always believed in uh, Having fun with whatever you do, you know, you don't take it like so seriously. You're serious about your work for sure You have this really great work ethic, but you've built this fabulous group of friends around you, you know, actors that you dress, models, and um, everybody has, and you know, you're, you're endearing as a person. Yes? Give That's me. a lot of compliments for me. <laughs> but uh, tell me about, uh, what do you think about my clothes? I love your clothes. I love the fact that you play a lot with embellishment. You have fun with it. Right. Every season that you do, you're always coming up with something that's different. It could be beading, it could be, you know, like some of the stuff that we saw today. It's all these beautiful petals and these flowers. And I love handcrafts. Uh, I mean, I love, you know, everything has to be done very specially. Yeah, and there's and, you beautiful know, use paint, of two. Paint taking you know, it's just done. Yeah, it's amazing. So I love that. I love the fact that there is so much of detail in the place. So Lara, you know, I know you for many years, so I must also say that Don't you... Don't say how many years, <laughs> <laughs> But you know, I know you for so many years, you've remained the same to yourself, so which is great. Like we both have kind of grounded, uh, but you know, you are yet working in the film industry, you're yet doing movies and you're doing successful films now, I mean, the movies just released now. Uh, and you know, Let's you not talk about my sense of style in that. <laughs> no, I want to ask you something, you see all these new girls which have come out in the industry now, they're so like, there with the fashion scene. Yeah. What do you think about their fashion sense? Well, I think what I like is, is that it like they all heard a mentality or they all creating their individual style. Yeah. Was was say, I like the fact that the girls are trying to cultivate an individual style. Sometimes a lot of them end up start looking, you know, they, they focus so much on the girls who are the fashionistas on a Kangana or a Sunam that they start aping them and then, you know, they're losing that individuality. But a lot of the girls today have a really quirky, fun way of putting things together and it's quite out of the box. Don't you think the brands are taking over rather than the actors? You know, today it's all about which brand is going to push their product no, on the actors. I mean, but the fact of the matter is that everywhere we go today, whether it's an event, whether it's a film, whether it's an award yeah. ceremony, whether it's whatever, everybody wants to know, you know, who are you wearing, who are you wearing, that's the first thing. And then everybody's become very classist about who they are wearing, you know, so it's exactly. just become, exactly. yeah, exactly. I've got to be wearing, you know, Rocky as yes, well. But that whole idea of mixing I love that. things together, no, but the idea of mixing things together, you know, yeah. taking I think very important is to stick to your personality and take it forward, and that's very important. Uh, my third question, what is Lara Dutta style statement? <laughs> you know, you've been consistent with your fashion, I feel you're very elegant, very strong uh, woman who wants to be there, stand out, but yet have the class, the classicness. I think, yeah, for me, I think my style statement is definitely something that has, that is more, uh, you know, straight line, that is elegant, that's graceful. Um, after becoming a mom, though, now, I mean, it's all about utility, you know, so I don't want to lose. Look, not looking glamorous but I need to be able to you know pick up my daughter whenever I want to and then lug I don't know school bag ballet costume baby swimming float everything at the same time and make it look good <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna ask you one very stereotype question okay. what does style mean for you oh God. I mean, it's very predictable everybody asks me and I think for me style is about comfort and it's all about you know how you put yourself together for sure, but I think style, you know, has to be is an individual stamp. You know, you say something. You, it's an extension of your personality. Right. You know, so my personality one day could be the fact that I'm feeling really bo bo and carefree and free spirited, and that's my style. You know, so it's, I just feel that 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 my clothes are an extension of my mind, the way that I'm feeling that day when I wake up. What is it that I want to project to the world? Is it don't mess with me today? It's right. just not your day. <laughs> oh, is it I'm easy, I'm laid back. It's a fun day. I'm gonna roll with it. That's fantastic. Uh, la last question. Last, okay. last question. <laughs> Besides wearing my outfit, because I'm gonna be very diplomatic, not sure. give you a choice of my name. Yeah. Uh, which is one other brand which you would wear when it's the most amazing special night of yours? 
Well, I've had a uh, few special nights, and if I can, it's not what I would wear. It's maybe I'll I'll draw reference to what I did wear. Okay. Because then you know the wedding people, my wedding. Exactly. I always, always wanted to wear Elisa. Oh and, my God, my favorite designer too. <laughs> and Beautiful. my wedding dress was the most exquisite all the only all lace outfit that I have in my wardrobe. It was this most beautiful Elisa dress that we actually sourced wow. in Berlin. So you own a Elisa? Places. Yes That's I do. Fantastic. That's fantastic. <laughs> it's also the most expensive garment of course. in my closet. Uh, but yes, my wedding dress and uh, I would say that beautiful red sequin gown that Heyman Tribedi made for me that I won this university. Yes. I think these so two these things special moments will for you hang, in your life and, and these two garments will hang in my closet forever. Thank you, Lara, for spending Thank so much time with me. Thank you. <laughs> Take care and all the best. Thank you.